Good morning everybody, it's Monday today, start of another week. I don't know how many weeks it is now since we've been uh, doing this, but I just know it's a big long and a big high number. Uh, but I hope the people are still um, wanting me to keep doing it uh, and I will continue uh, to put the message on every day while I think that uh, people are still listening or looking at it. Um, not so good today, this is the first day really for a long time that we've had a rainy day like this and I think maybe for the next few days that's what it's going to be. Um, schools are back today so at least the school holiday week had a wee bit of good weather and maybe people won't be so uh, worried today about going back to work and school when the weather's not so good. So we had our service yesterday and I think uh, everyone who was there um, was very pleased to be there to be worshiping, worshiping together again. Uh, nearly full again yesterday, so um, that's been a great week, two services uh, with um, people uh, just so pleased to see other church friends again. Uh, if you were at either of the services this week, I'm just assuming that you're going to be coming uh, again because I know that you did let Marjorie know on the way out that you were coming, so just turn up people. If you haven't been at either service and you want to come to either service, please, you need to let me know because we are quite near the numbers for uh, as many as we can have. Um, so if, if you can't really just turn up, you need to let me know. But there isn't any problem. Just give me a wee phone, a wee text, a wee email. Then uh, we'll just be keeping ourselves correct with the numbers, with the social distancing. So I hope everybody's well. Um, not really much going on, I don't think. Um, busy day today. I'm going to go and try and do some uh, things at the bank and some things just uh, round about everywhere. Um, it was really nice yesterday to see uh, people we hadn't seen for a wee while. Uh, everybody seems to be keeping well and uh, I hope that you are as well. Uh, so take care everybody and I know that I did say that I'm going to move away from Sam's but I think t um, I quite like Sam's myself and since I'm doing the readings it's up to me what I'm reading so I'm going to continue with the Sam's this week again. Uh, there are a huge number of Sam's and it's only really when you start reading some of them you realise that some of the verses that you know in your head from, from the Old Testament uh, you realise that they've come from this psalm or that psalm. So today I'm going to read Psalm 16 and it's entitled A Prayer of Confidence. Protect me, O God, I trust in you for safety. I say to the Lord, you are my Lord. All the good things I have come from you. How excellent are the Lord's faithful people. My greatest pleasure is to be with them. Those who rush to other gods bring many troubles on themselves. I will not take part in their sacrifices. I will not worship their gods. You, Lord, are all I have, and you give me all I need. My future is in your hands. How wonderful are your gifts to me. How good they are. I praise the Lord because he guides me, and in the night my conscience warns me. I am always aware of the Lord's presence. He is near and nothing can shake me. And so I am thankful and glad, and I feel completely secure, because you protect me from the power of death. I have served you faithfully, and you will not abandon me to the world of the dead. You will show me the path that leads to life. Your presence fills me with joy, and brings me pleasure forever. Amen, and God bless the reading of Psalm 16. So, um, take care everybody. Uh, start of a new week. Uh, I don't know if anybody's got anything planned. Uh, I'm not sure what we've got planned for the rest of the week, but certainly today, not too much. It's a day for staying in, I think, and having tea and cakes. So, you know where we are. Give us a wee phone if you need anything. If you need any help with anything, you need to know anything, you need to get anything. If you can't get it, let us know and we will do our best to help you out. Uh, over the weekend we did have um, one or two people did knock our door and hand in uh, shoe boxes for Blyswood. So we are still collecting them. Um, it's the 19th today. I think we will make the end of the week 
the last week. So um, if you can, if you have anything for the shoe boxes and you want to bring it to the church on Wednesday or you want to bring it to church next Sunday, I think we will make next Sunday the last day for collecting anything for the shoe boxes. Um, thanks to everybody who has um, handed in uh, items for that. And we will take it to Blyswood next week then, if we can say next for, uh, Sunday for shoe boxes. So if you've got anything, uh, come to the door, let us know, we'll collect it, or you can bring it to the church on Sunday uh, and on Wednesday. And I know a number of people did do that, and a number of people have um, handed us in money too for the transport costs. So if you can help out with that, that's great. And other than that, we will see you tomorrow. Bye.